Miss Lucas yep. was looking pretty technical right there. Yep. Pink Fresh isn't here today, so he might, you know, channel in the Pink Fresh. Yeah, we can help versus the match. Gonna be on Pokemon Stadium 2 here. Very good stage for Fox and the kill Fox smash pretty early. There you go, nice shine approach already. I feel I'm gonna counter that with Nair. Ooh, Hyper. Ooh. Yeah, look at the combo already. 63% just of one good combo. Now Hyper Flame gets the reset as well. And, oh, look like he's trying to finish it. And he's running away, taking control of mid stage, making bacon pancakes approach. Oh, bad up B. Yes. And that's that was a, like he should have sweet spotted, I guess. Yeah, but that was a great S smash from Hyper Flame. Timed it really nicely. So bacon pancakes playing from behind right now. Let's see what happens. Very nice by Hyper. He's spacing on his opponent without you know being too close so that he can get punished. Yeah, he's doing a really nice job, and he's always running away when he doesn't have guaranteed combos and looking for that PK freeze to start something almost every time. Mm, that would have been a nice up smash right there. Almost a kill, possibly. Ooh! Oh. Jesus. Uh, and another My nice goodness. combo. My. Wow, he's not done. He is not done. Has to watch it with those up Bs, though. Yeah, but... Oh, wow! The raw up smash? He just ran, and he's like, you're going to be right here. Up <laughs> smashed him. They oh. said something. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's resetting his controller real quick. Oh, making pancakes must have some issues. So there we go. All right, but he's close to death. He has to watch out. There's a neutral air. Nice combo back on safely right there. Oh, wow. Dodging the Mechos. Uh-oh. There we uh -oh. go. Oh, no. Up smash from Hyper Flame. He had a perfect opportunity there. Beautiful right here. It's pretty much like um, the, they call him Falco sometimes. But of PM. And even though there is Falco in PM. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Lucas is the fourth Spacey, as we all know. Yeah. Oh, that could have been a chance for an up throw. But up it almost throw? never kills on Spaceys, as we see. Just oh, like that. Yeah. I see these fast fallers. Yeah, the problem with Lucas's up throw is it, it kills almost uh, completely dependent on the fall speed of the character. And of course, Spacey's have that incredibly fast fall speed. Maybe this time? Yep. There it goes. There it goes. Nice by Hyper. However, he was able to bring it back a little bit, uh, Bacon Pancakes. So all he needs is a couple more damage and an up smash, and it's over. And I really liked that approach from Bacon Pancakes. If you saw, he nared through the PK freeze. He actually ate it with his foot. And with a beautiful shine, this might do it. Wow. Bacon Pancakes. Oh my goodness, so delicious. Brings it all the way back, even two stocks here. Hyperflame needs to make something happen. Maybe take that lead on back. Wow, he just chased him all the way to the ledge. Very nice. But he has to watch it. Can he recover? That was a beautifully timed back air to interrupt that illusion. But it doesn't matter. Bacon Pancakes still doing just fine here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Double fair. Nice by Hyper. This could be it. And that's it. Nice. Beautiful edge guard from Hyper with that, that fair off of the platform and then forcing Bacon Pancakes to upbeat. So he just grabbed the ledge and that was it. Uh-oh. Got a little too confident, but gets no punish on him right there. Yeah, Bacon Pancakes needed that punish. That could have been a stock if he had landed maybe like an up throw up air or fully charged up smash. Wow. But now he's getting comboed for free here. Yeah, he might have to move a little bit faster. Hyper's just going all over him because he's standing still. There nice. we go. And that time he said, I know I'm in lag and you're going to feel safe, so I'm just going to run an up smash at you and see what happens. Worked out perfectly. Oh, oh nice grab. Nice SDI right there by uh, Hyper. Avoiding the up air. So we're looking for whoever can get this first combo going. Might be a nice spot dodge somehow dodging the Lucas grab. Oh, this might be a lot of damage. Oh, Hyper gains his place again. Resetting at neutral there. Looking for whoever gets to approach first. He gets over the PK freeze, but no up smash. Nice. Is he going to get it? Oh, oh, my goodness. On the regular getup. Wow. Wave dashed away. Wave dashed back because Bacon Pancakes thought he was safe. And a really quick F smash ends that game one. How does Hyper a bat? Flame. Like, that kid is like seven years old. And he just hit him all the way. Hey, he's not even a bat. That's a stick. That's a stick. He hit him with a little twig. Oh, my goodness. When I was seven years old, I can barely even kill a bug with a stick. That's interesting. <laughs> Very nice by um, Hyper right there. So he's maybe pulling some upsets on Bacon Pancakes. Yeah, channeling his inner, inner Pink Fresh, like you said. Yes, right there, <laughs> Hyper. Hmm. So, so what stage is actually good for Fox? Yeah, I know Pokemon Stadium 2 is because of the low ceiling. Also, I would assume um, possibly Yoshi's. Well, yeah, obviously the, the, Yoshi's, the Yoshi story was banned out here. Yeah. And I think Bacon Pancakes is actually looking for a small stage. Lucas, not exactly good on small stages because he doesn't have the additional option to run away and PK freeze, which Hyper Flame was doing a lot of. If Bacon Pancakes can recognize that, even though he, I'm, I know he's thinking about Green Hill Zone, the downside of Green Hill Zone is the high ceiling. Yeah. It's harder to kill, but that works both for him and against him because Lucas kills up almost yeah. exclusively as well. Mm -hmm. Against Spacey's, not as much, but it's just something to consider. He's, he's definitely thinking about the Green Hill Zone. I don't know what other counter picks might be good for him here. Um, Honestly, I think he should choose um, Mute City. 
Me that's what Eddie. I would have picked. That's that's what it, I, it is what you would have picked. Yeah, the definitely. other one I actually would recommend here, uh, WarioWare. I Wario feel Wario. like would be really good for him. Again, has the added ability of the fact that he might die early as well. Yeah. But it's close quarters the whole time. Oh, I see. But then, like, Fox doesn't kill so much off the sides, and Lucas mm -hmm. might have more kill power, especially with those F smashes. He has to watch out for that. So here right. we go. Battlefield, Battlefield is going to be your counter pick here for Bacon Pancakes. And let's nice see how that works. Choice. Ooh, tries to go for that up smash after the up tilt. Didn't quite go right in front of him. Ooh, Hyper. Yeah, that was a really nice combo there by Hyper Flame. He definitely knows his combos on Spaces. He's been practicing that. Okay. Good approach from Bacon Pancakes, but it's like he's panicking. He went Nair into full rapid jab. Yeah, it's it's pretty easy to stop that too. So it's shocking that the full one. Oh my Ooh. goodness, that might be a kill. Wow, nice sweet spot right there. And also a really nice tech too. After he took the first hit, he teched the middle of Battlefield and managed to survive that hit. Nicely oh done goodness. by Bacon Pancakes. Bacon Pancakes has to stay out of shield. He's shielding too much, letting Lucas do whatever he wants on him. Not as bad as like Lucario attacking your shield, but it's still tough. You don't want him to just be styling all of your face. Anyway, he's already lost his stock now, and Hyperflame going super ham on him right now. Oh my goodness, 55 damage off of one combo from Respawn. That up air does finish the stock here, so it's three stocks apiece, but one more combo, and it might be the end of Bacon Pancakes. Oh, that oh. PK freeze didn't come out. This is the Hadouken. Wow, so beautiful with that. He's not going to punish after. Hyperflame is so technical with these these magnets. Of course, magnet doesn't exactly have a hitbox during its startup flames, but if you jump cancel it, the hitbox comes out faster than normal. Oh my wow. gosh. Really no tech. Yeah, and bad DI from Bacon Pancakes too. He should Ooh. not be DIing in. And again, another S smash to take the stock here. Hyperflame. He knows his Fox matchup for sure. Oh my goodness. Hyper. 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 Oh my. Wow. <laughs> Hit him with the PK freeze, didn't do anything because Fox's up B hitbox a bit too big. Oh my gosh, Hyper knows ex it's like he trains against Fox every day of his life. Yeah, right look now. at Boss freaking out in the background like this guy. <laughs> this guy is throwing some crazy moves out here. Oh my gosh. Oh, <laughs> barely gets over that S smash. Maybe again? Alright, Bacon. Alright, Bacon. Oh, he goes for the shine spike, does not get it though. That dash attack is gonna be a mistake oh. and up throw? Back oh, throw. Back throw, nice. Not good DI right there, and it's gonna be edge guard. And the other thing about Bacon Pancakes is he's picking really bad recovery options because he's recovering to the stage and not to the ledge. Mm, and Hyper yeah. Flame is punishing it every time. Yeah, Hyper Flame is always looking for him to recover to the stage. Nice kill right there with the up air, but he's an entire stock behind. It's going to be tough. Let's see, Bacon. All right, so here we go. Two stocks to one. Bacon needs to make something happen right now. A Gimp would definitely help him out. He has a grab. He can start making something happen. But nice SDI from Hyper Flame says no thank you. Yeah, Hyper Flame has definitely been practicing against the Fox a whole lot. Ooh, shine, shine. Going for the shine spike. Oh. He almost air dodge killed himself, but thankfully Lucas has that tether option and he made it back. All right, this is Bacon Pancake story right now. Up air, SDI's it every time. Hyperflame, you are very on top of that. Oh my gosh, and running up smash. Nice shine. He's catching wow. Hyperflame dropping shield every oh time he nares. But this is his last stock. And he's gonna cover on stage, but he's able to get it this time. Can he hit the up smash? Nope. Good and, and <gasps> a throw. Oh. Oh. Nice! Great patience from Bacon Pancakes. Sot, I can't hit you with up air. I know if you tech, I'll miss. So instead, I'm going to wave land on the platform and wait for an up smash. Beautiful patience. And now it's one stock apiece. Can you make it happen? Uh-oh. Yeah, and here comes the Lucas combos. It's starting. It's starting. Will it end? I don't oh. know. PK Burst somehow traded with Shine, I think? <laughs> yeah. That was a really weird trade there. Bacon Pancakes is trying to approach, not letting Lucas get all of his, like, momentum. He's looking for these shines. Oh, he doesn't punish, but he does get it with the shine. Oh, he saw the read, but then he moved too much. Nice Bacon. Fair. Hyperflame being very patient, waiting in center stage, doesn't want to die to anything. Oh, my oh, with goodness. the getup attack. He remembered. Oh, yay, yay. Nice Bacon Pancakes. Smash. Can he make it back? He does it. Not. A beautiful finish from Hyperflame to take it 2-0 in just the third round here. Yes, just third round. Very nice by Hyper. So does he come here often?